Today we're making Play-Doh. Why are we making Play-Doh? Because we got, because we got given to our teacher. Yeah, are we making it for your class? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It's so beautiful. Porter, what are you eating? <laughs> this is how I know Porter is my child. He just eats bagels. <laughs> And I do that too. Ha <laughs> ha! You, are you gonna help us make some play doh? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, so like Grayson said, we are making play doh. I volunteered back in August at the open house to make play doh with the boys. So I did this once before in October. I don't think I vlogged it. Uh, but we made orange play-doh and it was actually really easy They like give you the instructions and it's really easy to follow so this time they want us to do a different recipe so we are gonna try it this one it's with coconut oil um, which I didn't even have I, my mom actually went out and got some for me because who uses coconut oil although I guess there's a lot of health benefits to it so hopefully it Okay, I'm almost done. So hopefully it goes well. Um, this time for January, it's white Play-Doh. Last time we had to do orange, so I had to find orange food coloring. This time we don't have to add any food coloring to it, so it should be pretty easy. So we've put in some flour. Next, we need to do some salt, a third oh, cup of like salt. It. So we are going to try this. Hopefully it goes well. And... Oh, yeah, I'll just keep you guys updated, but yes, I volunteered to do this, so we'll see how it but goes. Hi guys, we're still making Play-Doh. <laughs> yep, so Porter stirring, we added cream of tartar, tartar, whatever, salt, which we had just enough salt, thankfully, uh, flour, and coconut oil. And now we are boiling water and then you mix it all together and then I guess it's done. So hopefully it comes out right. Grayson's class is depending no, on it. No, it's your turn. So we'll see. Porter is stirring. We stirred it all together, so now we just gotta add the water. We'll see how it turns out. Okay, so here is our Play-Doh, I had to add a little more water and a little more flour because it was a little dry. I don't really know that this recipe is much better. I feel like the other one made a lot more, but I used what they gave me, so it turned out well. It's white, so that was super easy. I've been kneading it because that's what you're supposed to do, but I guess it's kind of sparkly. It's probably hard to see, but I think it's supposed to look like snow. So anyway. Turned out well. I'm gonna put it in this baggie and then grow to get to school on Monday. I made the boys go away because they were making a mess with the bagel. And now they're playing Pokemon with daddy. So anyway, that is our adventure for the day. And now I'm going to sweep and mop my floors because there's bagel all over them. I wonder why. So fun. There's probably like bits of bagel in this Play-Doh, but what can you do? So at least I did it. I did my due diligence. I helped out <laughs> what little I could. Things to do, it, like making it at home on my own time is the best thing I can do just because with two kids yeah. I'm pregnant. It's just a lot. So anyway, I'll vlog as we go on through the day. Oh, I didn't even tell you guys the biggest thing that happened today, which was Porter did not take a nap. I put him down for a nap and he was crying, crying, crying. Couldn't understand why. So I went up there to like maybe rock him. Maybe that would like make him feel better or something. And as I walked into the room, apparently Porter had pooped and I don't know how he did it, but he was able to take off three layers of clothes. He had a sweater on, sweatshirt on pants and a onesie a buttoned onesie take all that off and then he stripped his diaper off because he had pooped and he put the poop 
Well, at least it was just like sitting there on the... You did take a bath, didn't you? The poop was just sitting there on his sheets, but it was all over his sheets. Um, thankfully, he didn't get it too much else. I had to clean some of the rails on the crib. But we already did laundry this morning because he was soaked and super wet this morning. And so now I'm doing laundry again. I'm hoping to get the poop stains out. I've sprayed his clothes with like a spray and wash twice. So we'll see, but otherwise the his sheets might just be done so I don't know. So yeah, that was my fun today. Kids. So anyway, I'm gonna go clean and I'll pull out the camera in a little bit. Ready, go. <laughs> Tell Grace and watch his YouTube videos. Uh -oh, what are you gonna build, morning. Gray? It's so we're downstairs. It's after dinner. Porter keeps taking his diaper off and his clothes. Grayson is working on magnet tiles. I'm building a five level hot wheels garage, right? Okay, I want to see it. Quarter is deteriorating because he did not have a nap today because he was poopy. So he's deteriorating. Maybe we'll put him to bed early tonight. That would be a treat. You want to do your sticker book? Yes. I feel like with him taking off his diaper when it's wet, like I should potty train him. I don't know. Grayson's potty training like left a, left a bad taste in my mouth. I tried to do it with Gray when he was mm, not even two and a half. He was like two years old and three months or something. And I tried for a month and he did not potty train. And then finally I potty trained him like two months before he turned three and he got it. And even then it took us like a month before he was actually like going on his own. So... I feel like I should try I with Porter the before the baby good. comes. I you want to do the stickers? Okay, you got to find them. Yeah. But we have like two trips coming up, and so I don't know how I want to do that. Two. Like, do I really want to try potty training when we are about to go and like travel and yeah. stuff? Like, the boys are about to go stay with Anthony's parents for a long weekend, and then we're going to take the kids to. We're uh, Florida for a long weekend, so I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know. It'd be nice to have him potty train, but I just feel like it's gonna backfire like Grayson's. I don't know. I guess I'll think about it. But anyway, we're just hanging out down here. I'm tired. This pregnancy is I'm making tired. me exhausted. No, I so that's all I can do no, to just I sit on the couch you. and watch the boys play. No, I'm tired. You ready to go night? No, I don't. Okay. 